Hello, my friends, and welcome back to Doom 2. We are here on map four, the focus. All right, let's see. Only one way forward, I think. So let's, let's do it. Ooh. Oh, there's all kinds of stuff going on. Oh, somebody made the chain gunner mad. Ow! These guys deal a lot of damage. They're actually pretty dangerous. You know, when I'm going into a new area, up until now, zombie men and shotgunners, like, they're hit scanners, so, you know, you need to pay attention to them. But they're, like, not that bad, right? In terms of how much damage an enemy is going to do to me. Uh, the humans are fairly low on that list. But these chain gunners are actually like pretty deadly. They will they will take chunks out of your health real fast. All right. Oh, Spectre. I saw you. Where'd you go? I don't see him there anymore. I hear him. There he is. Got him. What was that? Something opened. Hello? Hmm. Ah, snips. All right. Let's see. I see that misaligned texture. Nope. <laughs> okay. Beautiful. Also seeing the uh, enemy counts get reined back in to a more reasonable level. Very, oh my god, happy with that. Kind of disappointed at the lack of light. Which seems to persist, although it is used much better here. It is like, it's specific rooms instead of just literally everything. One could argue that maybe I should stop complaining about the level of light and just mess with the gamma settings already. You would be a smart man for suggesting such, but I am more hard-headed than that, so I will continue to whine about it until I actually have no choice. Hmm. Okay... I feel like I saw that come down at some point. I knew it! I knew I saw that come down. Alright, we got the red key. There is a teleporter back here. This whole thing is marked as a secret, so where does this take me? Back here. Did I hit this? Yes, I did. So I have no use in being back there. Oh! Hold on, hold on. There's something. Hi! Okay. Ooh. Oh, yeah, look at all this ammo. Okay, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, back to the red door, I guess. Now, what is going on down there? What do we got? Okay. Oh, see a couple chain gunners up there. Got them. There's five enemies left. Let's jump down here. Ow. And we have a teleporter. Oh, I was expecting this to be a lava pit. It is not. Okay, and we have another teleporter over there. These probably take me up to the sides. So let's head on up. There is nothing here. 
Oh, and then that takes me back to that side. But I need to go to that side. There's a switch on the wall there. The last enemy, I imagine, is probably in the exit. Sure is. Beautiful. All right, moving right along. What was this? The waste tunnels. Okay. See, now I'm not sure what to think because you're starting me off. Hey, hey, no. Ah, wait. Okay. Ah. Ah. Okay. Where are you? I was going to say, you're starting me off with a full sphere, which I'm conditioned to be extremely concerned about. But I guess that's just because of the chain gunners. Like, the difficulty curve of Doom 2, at least, you know, for map 5, is very reasonable. So, this is not necessarily something to be scared of. Like it would be in Vigil. No! Oh, wait. Okay. I accidentally hit, uh, I hit load, but I happened to hit save at the same moment, so I think we're fine. Ow. Okay. Let's go out here. Take out these imps. Oh! Oh! I have to say... Back when I was playing Doom regularly, I... One, I always preferred the original Doom to Doom 2. And that was largely down to... I felt like a lot of the maps I had played for Doom 2 felt lazy. And I attributed that at the time to the wider array of enemies, the super shotgun. It seemed like... Let's see. I think... I wonder if I can jump out that window to get to there. It seemed like having all of these extra resources made mappers lazy. And that it was way easier to make something a challenge when you can just open a door and oops six arch vials and I never I never liked it. Well I'm gonna go ahead and pick this up now. Let's see. Hello? Who goes there? Who's shooting? I don't know. Hey, is this a door? Ooh. Whoa, what is going on here? Well, I have since come... Oh. I... Rude? I've since come to the conclusion that that's... I mean, that might be true, but... What else we got in here? There we go. But that's not the primary thing, the primary issue, I guess. I think... I think now I have a better appreciation for the roles that... Ah! Ah! For the roles that different enemies fill and that the Super Shotgun fills. That was the other thing, is I didn't like that you would start a map, and a lot of maps, the first thing they would do is give you the Super Shotgun, and then that's basically the only weapon you would use. Whereas in Doom 1, 
yes, the shotgun's really powerful, but it's also situational, right? If you're facing a horde of lost souls, the shotgun is not the right weapon to be using. You really want to be using the chain gun. And if you're facing off against a Baron, using a shotgun on, on a Baron really sucks. You can do it in a pinch if you have to, but it's really not a fun experience. You really want to be using a plasma gun. So the different weapons and enemies have different roles and fill different slots. Right? And I have a much better appreciation for that now. I forget what my original point was. I had been intending to, to tie that to something that I was going to say, but I took so long to say it that I don't remember what my point was. Oh well. If it was important, I'm sure it'll come up again. Let's see. Where are we trying to go here? There's a door over here. Okay. Ooh, so generous with the ammo. I love it. I love it so much. Okay. All right. Let's see. I think we can go this way. Hmm. I don't have the red key. I need to go in here. That's not open. Can I go back around there? Can I do anything here? Hello? Oh, I see the red key. I also see enemies in there. Let's see, where... Oh. Oh, there's a door here. Okay. Yes! Health and ammo. Ah! Okay. Let's... Push the chain gun for these guys. Okay. Beautiful. Okay. How are we doing? Got about 30 enemies left. We haven't found any secrets yet. Ooh. Ah! Where did you come from? Little hole in the wall? Uh oh. That was almost really bad. Go ahead and take that. Ooh. Ooh, a berserk! Wonderful. Does this open somehow? No? Hmm. Can I just go through here? No. Looks like it probably opens from the other side. Can I go back up here? I feel like... I don't know why, but I have a vague memory of... There being a wind up on one of these windows? Or something? Hello? Ah! Sneaky bugger. Is there like... I thought I have... I have some memory of needing to like run through the windows to get there. I don't know why I have that memory. Hmm. Anyway, 
Let's see, we have not been through this blue door yet. It's... Oh, because I don't have a blue key yet. Okay, I have not been through... Oh! Ah, uh, yes, the Hell Knight. What do you do when you want a Baron, but you don't want him to be tanky as all get out? Enter the Hell Knight. A sorely missing uh, resource from in Doom 1. Okay. Mm, now I have the blue key. So I can go in there. Alright. Let's see what we got going on in here. Can't see what I'm shooting at, but I can hear them. Kako! Oh, that's glorious. Taking down a Kako in three shots. I love it. Now, let's mix it up a little bit. Let's use a rocket for this one. There we go. Beauty. I assume those are specters or pinkies down there, but I can't see them. Whoa! Always with the teleporters. I don't like teleporters. Hit somebody. Ah! Oh! Ah! Dirty! I was not expecting that. Touche. Alright. Now. I think I want to go... Whoops. I need to go down there. Is that... Now, surely I can drop... I can make that. Try that again. Yeah. I'm cutting it too close to the wall. Is this not the right way in here? Do I need to... Hmm. Oh, it's a secret. Okay. Hmm. What do you suppose the right way to get over there is? One of these walls, perhaps? No. I can't just get over there, huh? Alright, well. I'm not gonna keep trying. Let's just get out of here. Alright, let's squeeze one more in here. The Crusher. Whoop. Ooh. What was that? Oh! Behold the Revenant! That escalated quickly. Okay, I would appreciate some health and some armor right about now. There's some health. Ow! What is that? What's that? What's that noise? I've heard that noise before. I don't like that noise. And I don't understand why that noise is on level six. I haven't even gotten to the first intermission screen. You can't be doing this to me. Okay, let's see now. There is a door back here. No? Uh -huh. 
I have a vague memory of a room like this that had a flickering light that triggered a secret. Is that this game? Is that here? No, maybe not. Okay, what's... Hi! Huh. Are you aware that you're not supposed to be here? Let's, uh, try that again. Okay, let's just... Nope! Okay. Okay, this is a problem. Oh, this is a problem. Okay. <sighs> yeah. Oh, yeah, this is a problem. Uh, what am I supposed to do about this? Exactly. I think... I think I can juke to get to that platform over there. If I angle it right... Nope, 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 nope. Okay, a couple things. First of all, let's wait for the lift to come up. And then let's save, so I don't have to keep waiting for the lift to come up. I need to tuck back more to the left. And forward. You still have to keep moving forward. Let's try this. Not even close. Huh. Huh. Yeah, not even close. Ugh. Alright, well, this is okay. Let's see, where is this taking? Oh! Okay. Did that bring the lift down? No, what did that do? Oh! Oh! I got it! The Crusher! Okay. I feel like that's not what that's supposed to look like. Oh! He's still alive. And he's probably very mad. Do I need to hit it again? Nope, it's coming back down. Okay. I'll feel more comfortable running around and figuring things out when he's not there. There we go. Yes, yes, okay. Ooh. Alright, there is a plasma gun there that I would like to take. Okay. Does this come down? Okay, beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, now what? That teleports me up to there. Huh. Maybe the platform, or maybe that door up here is open now? Let's go check that out. Oh! Oh! Ah! Ah! Okay. That is definitely the right place to go. Okay. Ah! Okay. Is there another one? What else we got up here? Don't have a blue key. Is this open yet? No. Huh. Okay. 
So... Now what? Okay, there's the blue key, so I need to figure out how to get up there. So that'll teleport me here. Huh. I can get over to that side. That's probably not the lift, though. Yeah, this just teleports me here. That's not really that useful. So let's go back up. Where... Do I go next? Let's... Nope! Ah, shoot. Not what I meant to do. Take me up! Want to go this way. Oh! Okay. Hey, that works. Does that stay down? It does not. Okay, so let's trigger it and just run. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. All right. Is there... Ooh, a soul sphere. Gladly. Okay, nothing else up here. But now... I can go this way. Oh! You know what? Let me play that back. I think I can make that jump. Let's come back over here. Save. First. Ooh! Ow. Ah! Take it easy. There we go. Wow, there's... I'm just noticing, there's actually a lot of enemies left. Oh! Ah! Okay, they're below me. Uh, what's the best way to deal with this? Maybe... Can I see them if I come over here? No. But maybe I lured him over here so I can get across there now. Yep, excellent. Oh yeah, there is a couple guys down there. Okay, well let's see what we can get from these cages. We can get some plasma, which, you know, is conceptually nice, but since I don't have a plasma gun yet, not actually that useful. Okay. Now... Okay. Beautiful. Now we can go across here. And go up here. You know, I wonder, I wonder how it knew to stop the crusher. That's like a special functionality. I don't know. I'm not familiar enough with what functions are available. Okay, so now we have a blue key. So now we can go in this door. Okay. Oh, going up. Not expecting to go up, I was expecting to go down. Ow! I love, 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 love getting to take out two or more imps with a single shot. Alright, what do we got down here? Hello? 
Ah! up there. Oh! It's fine. Ooh. Actually, I am a little low on shotgun ammo, so let's use some rockets. Beautiful. Now I can get over here and pick up some shotgun ammo. Huh? Okay. I would also like... Yeah. That is exactly what I wanted. Okay. Now we can come up here. Beautiful. This is interesting. This whole thing raised up. Okay. And I hear a lift moving, but not quite sure where to place that. Can I get in here? I'm pretty sure I can get in there. Alright. Let's flip around here. Save. Load that back. There we go. This looks sus. Hello, doggy. Ha <laughs> ha That was wonderful. I will happily take all these goodies. Okay. Uh, now. Okay, this was all just a secret area. Okay, that's fine. So, where to next? Just back out this way, I guess? So what's different now? I guess we have the red key, which I don't think we had before. Whoa! Which means I can go this way now. Ah! Okay. Beautiful. Who else goes there? Okay. Lots of ammo. Wonderful, wonderful. This, I imagine, is the final room. Get all those specters out of there. Not sure when I picked up a plasma gun. Who's shooting me? Okay. That was exciting. <laughs> 
Let's see. So there's an exit door there. I think I need to take one of these teleporters into the middle room. Which I fell out of or something. So we'll trigger that. That, I think, yeah, brings up this walkway here. And that, I believe, is that. Very, very nice. Oh. You have entered deeply into the infested starport. Something is wrong. The monsters have brought their own reality with them. The starport's technology is being subverted by their presence. Ahead, you see an outpost of hell. A fortified zone. If you can get past it, you can penetrate into the haunted heart of the Starbase and find the controlling switch which holds Earth's population hostage. Alright, and I think that is a good place to leave that one there, ladies and gentlemen. I want to thank you so much for watching. I'm really enjoying sharing this with you. And I'm very much looking forward to continuing with this and the additional megawatts beyond. If you're enjoying this, please hit that like button. It really helps me out. It helps bring more people to the channel that we can share these wonderful games with. I want to thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time.